Hmm. Little goody two shoes. For goodness sake, there goes my last match. For goodness sake! Oh, I'm so tired of this place. Wash my sheets, Elise. Sweep my floors, Elise. Elise, Elise, Elise! <laughs> oh, I'd show them. <laughs> I'd make them scrub my pots and pans, my shoes even. Have them wipe down all my windows, every last one. Clean out my hearth and fetch me some water. Better yet, I'd have them running around calling me Elise all day. Oh, if only I were rich. All the steak I could ever want. All the shiny dresses. One for each day of the week with shoes and jewels to match. And maids! All the maids I could ever want. Oh, if only. Well, one can dream. Lise! Oh, for goodness sake! Uh. Near where you home, lass? What are you doing wandering around in the dark, Elise? You ought to know it's dangerous out here. I'm not wandering about, Mr. Ludwig. I've been working late, if you'd be so kindly believe. You know better than to put yourself in danger, Elise. If anyone's putting me in danger, it's you. I'd be home already had you not stopped me for an earfall. Come now, Elise, we've got good reason to worry. All this vigilance for what? 
What am I to be afraid of? The witch? Watch your words, Elise. You're not to question such matters. What do you say we walk you home? I believe I'll be just fine on my own, Mr. Heinrich. No more detours, Elise. It's for your own good. Lest I come across the witch, I know. Let us hope you don't come to regret your words, lass. Oh, I can't stand these folks. Ah, okay. Find a way home. She's probably that way. Shoot, what? This thing's so faded I can't even read it. Left? Right? Up? Hmm. Oh, up, left is, I don't know. Okay. Obviously going left. Also, is there like a save? Oh. Hey, they're party things, too. I know, those are just... there's a path here. Oh? Pine tree this, pine tree that. Everything's about pine trees around here. You point... peak. You point? No. A peak. Here, uh, grapes. Cool. Hmm. I like grapes. Oh. For oh, for goodness sake! It's impossible to keep this lantern lit in this wind. Guess I'll be finding my way home in the dark, I suppose. Oh. Leave often. if I want to use up all the slave slots. Ah, here we go. I suppose I have to chop some more wood soon. Just when I'd gotten rid of all those pesky splinters and blisters. Covered in ancient scars, a tree trunk sits bare, its dry surface exposed to elements. Oh. Anything else? What in the Lord's name happened here? I have to find my matches. At least they didn't get into this trunk. Despite its visibly worn appearance, the old trunk keeps its contents safe and secure. Huh. Oh, thank goodness they didn't touch Granny's spinning wheel. leaving until I make sense of what happened here. I don't have the time to tidy this mess up. A big 
shiny iron pot, its inner surface is covered in scratches. I have a room. What's this filthy thing on my wall? Whoever broke into my house is getting a proper earful. That's that. No use going into my pantry, is it? There's nothing to eat in this house. Okay, it looks like it's upstairs then. Maybe. When the Lord's name got into my house. Oh. Oh no. Ooh. What? What was that thing? I was I dreaming or What was I thinking leaving it here? I have to light the fire now. Serve your matches. Light the lantern using matches. Be careful not to waste them. Okay. Light the fireplace. I really ought to go through all this junk sometime, I suppose. Small wooden trunk filled with various knickknacks. Endings, huh? This thing's still not working, is it? I ought to have a word with Mr. Wilhelm sometime soon, I suppose. The clock's hands grate beautifully through time, struggling to turn each passing second. It's been a long time since I've gone into Granny Holo's room. Not that there's anything to see there, anyhow. Oh. What? Good grief. Yes. What if it was that witch that Tonsfolk have been going on about? Keep it together, Elise. No, keep it together, Elise. It was definitely a burglar. That said, I'm not going anywhere anywhere without my broom. Oh, I already got the broom. How long has it been since I last used this thing, I wonder? Cobwebs and dust cling to the old oven's wooden doors as though sealing them. There you are, you shameless thief. Give me back all you took. Right. Now! Wait, please. Please forgive me. Explain yourself, you wretch. What were you doing in my house? Wait, please, don't hit me. I was just hiding. There were these men, and I... I want to ask you a second time, thief. Give me back anything you took right now. I didn't take anything. I was just scared. Please, I beg of you. Show me your hands. I didn't take anything, ma'am. Now show me your pockets, and make it quick. I'm telling you, I didn't steal anything, ma'am. This is all I have, I swear. Coins and weeds. 
What are you doing up here in the mountains? I'm a traveler, ma'am. Turn around. You say you're a traveler? Are you all by yourself? Yes, I'm traveling alone. I hoped I could rest for the night in this village, but I saw some people walking in the woods. It frightened me, so I ran to find some place to hide. If that isn't May, you're still... Oh, please forgive me, ma'am. I didn't mean to make such a mess. Would you stop calling me that? I'm... I'm sorry. For goodness sake. Alright then. Well... I might let you go, if you can prove your innocence, that is. I don't know what else I can do, ma'am. Well, you can start by cleaning up this mess. And then you can... Ma'am? Yes, that's it. I made! Listen carefully now. First, we'll be tidying up the mess you made. In fact, you can clean my whole house from top to bottom. That'll teach you not to go storming into strangers' homes. I... ma'am? Complaining already, are you? Wouldn't you agree this is the least you can do? Yes. Oh, of course. I'll gladly do it, ma'am. Good. And in exchange, I suppose you can stay here. But no more thieving. I am not a thief, ma'am. I'll be the judge of that. Thank you very much. Anyhow, you work for me and I'll give you a place to stay. Fair enough, would you say? It does sound fair, ma'am, and it is very kind of you, but... I am not a thief. Fine, you're not a thief. Now, would you stop calling me ma'am? Do I look like an old hag to you? Sorry. You don't, I apologize. Right. My name is Elise, and you better remember it. Yes. Ah, yes. I'm so sorry, I forgot to introduce myself. Ah, Rosen Marine. Lenick Wanderer. <laughs> My name is Rose Marine. It's a pleasure to meet you, Ms. Elise. For goodness sake. For goodness sake, just Elise is fine. Come now, you have a lot of work to do. Yes, yes of course. Hmm. Any more of this? was down here? Ah, fields. This isn't the time to be watering the garden, is it? Weathered by time, the whale's wooden structure stands frayed and worn. Okay. That's there. Why could you even do all this? I got my floors. I'm so sorry. Even Granny's plate shattered to pieces. What are you, a wild boar? I'm surprised you didn't break my windows and tear down the walls. Alright. Well... You know what you did. Anyhow, here, take this. Make certain you get into every nook and cranny you hear. Yes, ma'am. While you're at it, you can sweep the chimney and clean out and clean out the fireplace, too. Oh, and wipe that stain off my wall and wash all my windows. All right. I want this place sparkling by the time I wake up tomorrow, understood? Of course. Of course, ma'am. I told you to quit calling me that. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Come now, let me show you to the well out back. Oh, I, oh, I can do it myself, Elise. Anything to make up for what I've done. Look here, lassie. I have no good reason to trust you. I didn't mean to. Every single corner of this house is to be absolutely spotless by sunrise. You gotta cross me even once and I'll have a word with the townsfolk. Are we clear? Yes, Elise. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll do my best. Be careful not to wake me either. I have Sunday Mass to attend tomorrow. I'll keep quiet. Good night, Elise. Uh. 
Ah, oh, you've done me, Elise. Hardly a need to be that harsh, but still. What if she's dangerous, or worse, even, what if she's the witch and the townsfolk have been talking about? What will Granny Holo, Holo do, I wonder? She didn't raise me like to be like this. I even threatened to tell her tell on her too. Aww. What's done is done, I suppose. I'll make sense of this tomorrow. It's best I go to bed. <laughs>